Hello everyone, this is Tanishka from Edureka and I welcome you to this session. This session is all about how to create an Azure free account. So before we get started, make sure you subscribe to Edureka YouTube channel and hit the bell icon to never miss any updates. Now let's quickly look on to our agenda. In this session, we'll be discussing what is Azure, what we'll get with Azure free account, how to create an Azure free account, how to create Azure free account without credit card, can we delete a credit card and how to cancel subscription. So let's get started. What is Azure? The Azure Cloud Platform is more than 200 products and cloud services designed to help you bring new solutions to life to solve today's challenges and create the future. Build and run application across multiple clouds, on-premises, and at the edge with tools and frameworks of your choice. So if you give a proper definition to it, then Azure is a public cloud platform with solutions including infrastructure as a service, platform as a service, and software as a service that can be used for other services such as analytics, virtual computing, storage, networking, and many more. Now let us understand what you will get after you sign up for Azure free account. So basically you get many things for one year which includes $200 credits for first 30 days, popular services free for 12 months, more than 40 other services which are free all the time and 750 hours of virtual machines which includes Windows and Linux and you can create up to 250 GB SQL database. Apart from this, you can get other services like free dev test labs, free load balancers, free batch jobs, free SQL server, etc. Now we'll see how to create an Azure free account. For this, you require a phone number, a credit card, a GitHub or a Microsoft account to create your Azure free account. The best way is you can create a Hotmail or a Outlook email ID and then you can use the same email ID and password to sign up for the Azure free account. So firstly, you need to sign in through the Microsoft account using your Outlook, Hotmail or any ID. And after that, you need to follow the couple of steps that is you need to first fill out about you and then you will go through a verification by phone and then you go through the verification by card and finally you sign up. In the first step that is about you, here you fill up your basic details that is first name, last name, email ID and phone number. Then followed by next step that is identity verification by phone. So here you give your phone number and you receive an OTP and you need to just like type your one time password and just verify your phone number. So once you're verified, you move on to the next step that is identity verification by card. Here you fill up your all credit card details followed by card hold number, then credit card number, its expiry and CVV and your address. Once all it is done, then they charge you around 2 rupees just for your verification. They charge you 2 rupees and it is deducted. Once it is deducted, you move to the next step that is like accepting the agreements. So you need to just tick mark all the agreements and finally you sign up. So once all this process is done, then you are ready to start with Azure. So this is how you create your Azure free account. It's very simple and super easy. So now let us know how to create an Azure free account without a credit card. So can we do this? So the answer is yes. Yes, you can. You can create an Azure free account without a credit card. But for this, you need to have an, a school account or a required school email ID. So you basically log in as a student. In this case, if you log in through a student account, so you will receive only 100 credit points and you also get various other services like 750 hours Windows virtual machine, and you can create up to 250 GB SQL database and um, you also get machine learning free workspaces, SQL server developer edition that is also for free and lots of AI and machine learning features. This is how you create your Azure free account without a credit card. 
Now let's move on to the next topic that is can we delete a credit card? So many of us had a doubt that can we actually delete our credit card? So here in this picture you could see that I have a payment method and here the delete option is disabled. So why is this so? In this case you cannot delete a credit card as it is there is only one payment method option. If you really want to delete a credit card detail then you need to add one more payment method. So you can click on to this add icon and you can add your new payment method. Once the payment method is added then your delete option gets enabled. Then after that you get the access to delete any one of your credit card details. So this is how you delete a credit card detail. Next how to cancel subscription. So it is very easy to cancel the Azure subscription. So for this you just need to go to cost management section. There you get go to subscription option. Once you click on to the go to subscription, you get all the details of your current subscription. So, and you can also find the cancel subscription option there. So, once you click on to the cancel subscription, they will ask you the type of subscription name and you need to provide a reason on why are you cancelling the subscription. So, you just give the reason, prescribed reason of your own and then just click on cancel subscription. So once you click on to the cancel subscription, they will ask you the type of subscription and the reason why you want to cancel the subscription. So you can give your details accordingly and click on cancel subscription. So this is how you can cancel your Azure subscription. So this was all from my end. We learned how to create an Azure free account with credit card and without credit card and how can we remove credit card details and how can we cancel the subscription. So this was all from my end. So I hope you enjoyed this session. And if you are interested in Azure online training certification, then do check out the link given below in the description. Happy learning. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. Please be kind enough to like it and you can comment any of your doubts and queries and we will reply them at the earliest. Do look out for more videos in our playlist and subscribe to Edureka channel to learn more. Happy learning!